It's time to wake up, my little flower. Hey, come on, wake up, sweetie. I know you can hear me. You know you're quite terrible at pretending to be asleep. Now, come on, let me see those pretty eyes of yours. I miss them so much. I miss them so, so much. Hey, are you really still keeping your eyes closed? Do I really have to beg? Come on now, I don't mean to hurt you or anything. I mean, I could have just tied you onto a creaky old chair with rope, but I didn't do that now, did I? Instead, I've laid you down on a nice, comfy bed in my own cozy home. You know, you might actually believe me if you were to open those eyes of yours. Come on, don't be shy, my love. Let me see those eyes. Aww, there they are. I know it's only been a day, but I can't believe how much I've really missed them. You're... You're adorable. <laughs> so, my love, how are you feeling? Are you hungry? You must be hungry after all this. I mean, you're cute. Little Tummy was grumbling during the whole escape as I carried you. In fact, I almost, almost got caught because of the noise your tiny little tummy produced. <laughs> You're embarrassed, aren't you? Ah, you do look extra adorable when you're all embarrassed like that. I like it. Listen, I know so much had happened in this short amount of time, but I think, I think that I want to be your boyfriend. Mm, yep, I think I'll be your boyfriend. <laughs> oh, hush. You don't need to say anything, my love. Nothing at all. I'm your boyfriend now, and you're my girlfriend. Do you understand? Hmm? Hmm. That's not what I wanted to hear. Nope, nope, nope. Let me hear your answer once again. Do you understand? <sighs> you still don't understand, do you? Mm, you don't need to be so scared, my love. You know, I could have escaped sooner back in prison with the same method. But, but I had to make sure. I just had to make sure that you were the one for me. So I waited and waited and waited ever so patiently until my heart just screamed at me and told me that you were the one. You were the one I would be with forever. And because of that, I am obviously going to treat you with the utmost care, like a princess. Yeah. Anyways, it's okay that you don't like the fact that we're lovers now, but you'll love me someday. <laughs> You will love me one day, and I'll be patiently waiting for that day to come, just like I did in prison. I'd wait forever for you, my love. Forever. So, uh, are you perhaps comfortable? This bed does feel nice, doesn't it? <laughs> 
I'll have you know that I stole this bed from the best mattress and furniture store. But little did I know that a couple months down the line, a beautiful little princess would be laying on top of it. Oh, please, there's no need to be feeling humiliated, my love. Just lay down and relax. I can't imagine how tiring it is to be standing guard all day long back in prison. So do me and do yourself a favor and just relax. <laughs> Hmm, maybe, maybe you should take that uniform off. It doesn't look too comfortable. No, uh, you'd prefer to keep it on. Well, if you insist, my love. Just know that I have plenty, plenty of spare clothing for you. And don't you worry about where I got them. Don't you worry. So, if you change your mind, feel free to let me know. And I suppose I don't mind the sight of you in that uniform, since you do look quite ravishing. It is that same uniform that I fell in love with. Hmm? What's that? You're curious how I ended up in prison. Mm, sweetie, I... I don't know if I should tell you. Do you really want to know? Do you really, really want to know? How about this? Hmm, I will tell you what I did to get myself stuck in prison only. Only if you can be a good girl. What do I mean by that? Well, I mean no attempts at escape. You don't try to hurt me in any way. And you accept the fact that I'm your boyfriend now. <laughs> so, what do you say? Can you, can you, agree to those three simple rules? Aww. Take your time, take your time, and think it over carefully. There's no rush, my baby. Anyways, while you think it over, I think I'll grab us something to eat. I can't have my little princess here. Starve on me. Yes, my love. You don't want to eat. Huh? Why not? Your poor little Tommy is practically screaming for food. Say, are you lying to me? Don't lie to me now. Don't lie to me. I don't like liars. I know you're hungry. See, let me put my hand on your cute little tummy. Mm, there it goes, grumbling again. <laughs> uh, I swear, your tummy is the cutest thing ever. It's okay. I'm not mad at you. Just don't lie again, okay? At least not to me. I care about you, and I care about your health. After all, I need you to be in healthy condition, because I won't have anything less than a healthy girlfriend. And if you're not going to eat, well, I'll just have to tie you up and force feed you. So please, be a good little princess. Okay? Good. 
I will be back, my love. And remember, behave yourself, or you'll have to deal with my bad side. So please, 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 don't make me turn into my other half. Otherwise, otherwise I. Never mind. Just behave, all right, sweetie. Can you promise me that? Thanks. Mwah. I love you.